Arizona Dash Wrestling.com. Hey, what's up, Trey Escobar, Liberty High School. What's up, man? How's your season going? Good, pretty good so far. Nothing much. I wrestled, uh, had some good matches. Wrestled Jaden Abbas this year. Ended up beating him eight to five in the finals. Jaden Abbas. Oh, okay. Yeah. You beat him what score? Eight to five. In the finals. Yeah. You guys went to Vegas, right? Yeah. Is that who you wrestled there? No, I wrestled him at our tournament, Liberty Classic, earlier in the year. Yeah, I didn't get to make it to that one. It was like at the same time as uh, the Coyote Open. I was over there in East Mesa. But I've made it a point to try to go to that one next year, so I'll get to see you next year too. Well, where are you going this year? 32s. And that's solid? Like you're staying that way? Yeah, I'm coming down from like 146. Oh, so you're cutting. So this is not your natural weight. You're not walking around. So you're cutting to get down to 32. What do you walk around at? Like 45, somewhere 45, there? 45, 46. Dang, you cut, dang it. At least you're cutting and you know, all fat and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> so how you feeling? I feel pretty good. Um, I think 32 is a good weight for me. I mean, there's kids that are tall, but I know how to wrestle them. Yeah. I'm getting looks with Courtney and Henry and all them. So What's your record right now? I'm 18 and one, I lost one match. Who'd you lose to? I lost to some some kid named Scott Keanu from Poway. I just had a bad match. Was that in Vegas? Yeah. That was, yeah. I, I think wrestle. I did see that. I didn't wrestle my best. Couldn't wrestle better. Learn from it? Yeah. Watch the video already? Yeah. Well, guys, we're here at Fire Ready. Uh, getting a, a nice little practice in with some uh, very high-quality wrestlers here. So, uh, you come to the, are you coming to the clinic tomorrow? or? Um, I don't think so. I have a practice for school tomorrow. Oh, yeah. That's good you came in and get some different practices. So if you're solid at 132, um, you guys are at Peoria next? Yeah, Peoria. You guys will probably meet up with uh, Sunnyside, Roman Bravo. Probably. But the only way, and you guys are both returning champs. Are you looking forward to meeting up with him in the finals? Yeah, I mean, it'll be fun. I like to get tough competition, you know. I like to challenge myself, so. I mean, I don't really look at like, oh, I have whoever, if it's Roman or if it's Abbas, whoever, I just look at him as like, okay, another high level opponent for me to wrestle. Yeah, you did learn from those too. So you'd be probably seated number two, right? And he'd be seated number one. Or it'd be, it'd be you'd be either two or three, right? Because the Stone Crooks, I believe, is in your weight class. How do you fare with him? Um, I haven't wrestled him too much, but I mean, we go a lot. I haven't wrestled him in a long time, but we go back and forth when we wrestle. So you probably have to get past him in the semis. You looking forward to that? Yeah, it'll be fun. Like I said, just getting the tough matches just like just makes me better. Yeah. No matter the outcome. Yeah. Have you studied uh, Roman at all to try to prepare for that high level of a match? Not really. I mean, obviously I gotta have a game plan going into the match. You know, because I mean, I can't just go in and just like do whatever. But what, is, what is the game plan? It's a secret. It's gonna be a secret. That's good. So, uh, how's everything else going besides uh, looking forward for the future? Have you changed anything about the way you practice this season? Um, I mean, I think for me, it comes down to like building my technique um, and really just focusing on things that I need to work on. And going hard is good, but I think training smart is also is awesome. You have to have that balance. What's your diet like? Um, right now I'm not on a diet because, you know, like I have a little bit, but usually I am like have chicken and rice like six times a day, drink a lot of water, like a gallon, and, and you know, sweat a lot, practice, and it usually gets me down to weight. Are you, uh, are you planning on wrestling in college? Yeah, I am. Um, what colleges are you kind of leaning towards? Well, there's a few colleges that I've been looking at me, like ASU, uh, Princeton, Stanford, um, West Point. So, um, I'm looking at a few different schools. That's good. How are your grades? Uh, they're pretty good. Um, I had, I think I have like a 3.875, something like that. I see you, you're here learning from uh, uh, Henry Cejudo too as well. You ever live wrestled Henry? Yeah, I've live wrestled How do you go with that? Um, it's pretty good. I've, uh, I've taken him down a few times. I'm wrestling tough with them, you know, I just like to go out, because, you know, even if they're really good, it doesn't matter, you just got to go all out. That's good, man, it's good. Well, you just keep going on balls to the wall, I guess, for lack of a better phrase. But, all right, man, well, uh, I'll follow up with you. I'll see you again at um, Peoria, yeah. and uh, good luck. Good luck for the rest of the season. I'll see you at Peoria, and then again at, uh, where are you guys going after Peoria? We have, um, I think we have our Sunrise Duel, our Rival Duel, and then I think we go to Oklahoma. I think I'm going to try to go to that one this year. I heard a lot of good things about it last year. All right, Trey.
Good catching up with you, man. Thank you. Thank you.